Waziri Mkuu Mheshimiwa Mzengo Pinda amesema serikali itaendelea kukazia maendeleo katika sekta ya kilimo ili kuweza kufikia malengo iliyojiwekea licha ya ukweli kuwa bado zipo changamoto nyingi zinazoikumba sekta ya kilimo nchini. Kutoka Morogoro mwana habari wetu Godfrey Monyo ana ripoti. Mheshimiwa Pinda amesema hayo wakati akihutubia katika maadhimisho ya miaka hamsini ya shughuli za shirika la misaada Marekani hapa nchini la USAID yalifanyika katika chuo kikuu cha kilimo sua mjini Morogoro. The government of Tanzania is committed to continue increasing resources to the agricultural sector in order to reach the target of 10% of the total budget annually which currently stands at about 7%. In the meantime The government has continued to address challenges affecting agricultural growth through various initiatives. Naye balozi mdogo wa Marekani nchini bwana Robert Scott na mkurugenzi wa USAID bwana Robert Kunen wamesema bado wana nia nzuri ya kuendeleza mahusiano ambayo yameanzishwa na viongozi waliotangulia Hayati Mwalimu Nyerere na Hayati John Kennedy. The importance of our relationship remains essential also to regional prosperity. Tanzania is a leader. It has great potential that is being realized it is evidenced by the fact that Tanzania is a focus country for nearly every current US presidential initiative USA began with Tanzania 50 years ago is as strong as the building you are looking at today originally built as a library for 50 years this building has served as a warehouse of knowledge Dr. Gerard Monela ni makamu mkuu wa chuo kikuu cha sua ambaye leo ameelezea mafanikio aliyopata kutokana na ushirikiano kati ya chuo hicho na Marekani kupitia USAID. We in strengthening the training and the research capacity of Soko University of Agriculture and the National Agricultural Research System. And they will enable SUA to respond to the needs in the agricultural sector for improving food security and agricultural productivity. Baadhi ya watu waliosoma chuoni hapo miaka ya nyuma wamesema wamefanikisha malengo yao kufuatia ujuzi waliopata chuoni hapo. My relationship with USAID and of course for many of my colleagues from Morogoro did not end here. In 1968 about eight of us received USAID sponsorship for bachelor's degrees in Ethiopia. Madhimisho ya miaka 50 toka shirika la USAID lilipoanza kutoa huduma zake hapa nchini Tanzania. Ambapo madhimisho haya yanafanyika hapa Chooni Sua. Nikiripoti kutoka Morogoro. Mimi ni Godfrey Monyo.